How's it going guys, RXXC here and we have a big news video for you today. Uh, before we get into that though, uh, if you look at the screen here, uh, we do have a little plug for Matrix Mats. Uh, Visual's here with me, he's the designer of all these things. Uh, this uh, link is obviously going to be down in the description. Uh, we do these mats, we do not make the mats, we make the images, we sell them, and uh, we do custom mats and stuff for you guys as well. So uh, this is the website, uh, everything you need to know about them is here. Uh, if you want to contact us with any questions, you can contact us here. And, of course, FAQs. Um, that should be able to help you. Um, anyway, uh, other than that, let's get into the juice. So, some... Uh, or, well, TCG Player, as you know, is partnered with Bakugan now. And so you can buy cards off of there. They have, like, official scans. It's, like, an official partnership. Well, uh, because Resurgence is starting to come out, or is coming out... Like tomorrow, right? Is it? Yeah. As a recording of this video, tomorrow, technically. Um, so, uh, there are Bakugan evolutions in the set now that we have. We don't have the Bakugan and stuff like that, so it was really confusing. Well, TCG Player just completely unveiled every Bakugan uh, character card for like the next like three waves something like that we're about to jump into wave four officially this stuff's looking like it's going to be five six seven maybe eight so this is a huge look into the future it's i must i'm saying it's a mess up on their part uh that we see all this stuff already but it's literally everything guys so uh me and visual are going to kind of break it down with you uh video might be a little long-winded but i think it's worth it if you want to uh, see what's going on, but obviously uh, I'll leave the link down in the description so you can check it out for yourself uh, and get some cool images and stuff for you to save. Uh, anyway, if you don't want spoilers, click away now because the first thing is a giant eyeball thing. Well, I guess that was a spoiler, but anyway, <laughs> click away now. Three, two, one. Ah, here we go. Kloptor Ultra. My dad. He is a flying eyeball Batman um, with 600B and two attack. Uh, a lot of the things you're going to start seeing, obviously we have Kobos here, a lot of the things that you're going to see in this set are like doubled cores that are good. Like there is a double magic shield in this collection here. I There's forgot what it was. also a double fire fist. Yeah, so things are getting wild. All right. So, uh, Claptor Ultra, uh, he's reminiscent of that old eyeball Bakugan from the olden days that I have no idea what his name is. It was literally just an eyeball with like a little thing. It was weird. Uh, but uh, Kloptor was in the show for like one episode. Uh, it was one of the bad guys, Bakugan. It was kind of random when he came out, and it was like a shock. Uh, so it's really cool to see him here, but he's only in Aquas, as we can see now. This is his house action? No, he was Darkest in the show. Oh, even better. I think. Yeah, he was. He's definitely Darkest in the show. Uh, so uh, we'll be getting more of him later, but again, this is way down the line. Uh, but these all have the resurgence... They do. Set symbol. But I think uh, somebody said that there are there's a new set symbol in here somewhere. Anyway, going on to Cubbos. So I think they all have, or most of them will have Resurgence because they'll all come out before we get the next cards. Yeah, because the next cards are like four months away. Yep. Yeah, so uh, we'll have Resurgence for a while. Anyway, moving into the Cubbos, oh, we there talk, are we a couple talk of about them. Him. About who? Do you think he's good? Do I think Kloptor's good? Just in this form. By himself, 602 in Aquas. Double Green Fist. Green Fist. Uh, being that that helps Pegatrix have an Aquas option, a decent Aquas option. What's Pegatrix's other Aquas option right now? Does uh, uh, no none. None. Yeah. So maybe. I don't think so. I don't think he has another one. It, I mean, this one's six hundred two with think, green fist, I, I so more damage. Good. So I think it'd be cool. Uh, if that thing evolves, it's gonna look wicked. I don't know how you evolve an eyeball. Give it another one. Give it another eyeball. Titan Kloptor Ultra is a face. I don't want him to have another eyeball. <laughs> right. He needs more wings. All right. Uh, going on to Kubo's. Uh, Kubo is cute. Uh, we have an Aquas one with a magic shield. Interesting. A Auralis one. Uh, 207. You can reroll uh, with that one. I think the Aquas one's good. A Darkest one. 105. Oh, yeah. If you land on... Oh. If you land on the magic, magic shield, it's plus 600. 600 so, base so if you land on the magic shield, it's plus 650. You get plus 1250. Right, so that's so cool. you're at thirteen fifty five. Yeah, there's another Bakugan that's there's a uh, 
You'll see later. I I don't know. I don't remember what I'm talking I don't about, think but the I don't or, remember. Orlis one's good. Yeah. Darkest one's not good. Darkest one's okay. Cubo. Bad. His house faction. Green Fist or Magic Shift Frost. No, thank you. Uh, the Ventus Cubo. Uh, three hundred six. But see, we don't have evolution, so we're just basing them off of the character yeah, we're cards based, themselves. Yeah, we're basing all of this off of what we see. Uh, we straight, have a straight battle image potential. of Kobo for you to gander at. I didn't do it. I'm not prepared. Anyway, you should know what Kobo Man. looks like. He is a... Uh, what do they call this? A sp the weird <laughs> the weird spin master things that they used to do. Anyway, uh, oh, moving on to yet. Cindius. Uh, we've seen all of these except this. Magic Shield Ventus, 207. So he could go up to 11. And then he gets more damage so on eight, the magic shield. 850, 11? Yeah. So. Decent. Yeah. Relatively decent. Don't have an evolution. Playing with Trox and Ventus, you get two magic shields and Ventus. So that's interesting. Uh, Pyrus one's bad. Yeah. This one. Good. We have seen already. Uh, this is new. New. Double and green good. fist. 3 3. Then plus 300 and 2. On a green fist, so if you're doing plus 250, no, 150, so four, so 750 with a lot of damage. 750. Interesting. Seven. Right, yeah. So, uh, a Aqua's Fangs or Ultra. I think this one could be Victor decent. Victor draw two cards? That's fun. This would be good based on this evolution. Right, yeah. If this gets. Because it'll a big be a Victor draw here. three cards. Right, right. Oh, yeah. That'd be nasty. Uh, Gorthions, none of them are... That one's blessed. not good. This one's, this one's okay. not the worst. That one's not good. Eight damage is interesting with a magic shield, but... 758. Not feeling it. Uh, Core Gorthion, nope. the normal self, not feeling it. No. I think the ones with low B kind of have a better chance at being good when they have the double core type. With Evo? Just that and like more playable potential for some because this will have this has holy flame, right? So it's it can't be awful. Oh, yeah, so it can get all. Yeah, yeah, yeah you're right. The, so the chaos, chaos low B power stuff with with green fist is. You have holy flame and bone defense. Yeah. We have a lot of Bakugan coming in with magic shields. One, two, three, Gorthions just having magic shields. Oh, so that's like interesting. It. I love magic shields. Uh, these are the same. Blue one seems good. But the same. They, with, they, they both have a magic shield. They are the same. Uh, that's weird. I, I'm not a fan <laughs> of Darkest. <laughs> yeah, Darkest. Just, I, I'm not a fan of the faction. I don't like their cards. I thought it was going to be fa my favorite faction just because I like dark type things. Right. But it's just not. Yeah. So, anyway, moving on to cool stuff. Woo. Hydronoid. Woo. This one we do have evolutions for. We're getting it. core Hydronoid. We have diamonds of this. Yeah. So, with these two actually right here. So, what are they? Uh, Diamond Hydronoid Core is a four cost with six hundred twelve. So he doubles. He literally just doubles himself. Does it do anything? No. Okay, so four cost to double yourself. That's not. That's not good for this one. What does this? What does the Ultra do? The Ultra is eight cost, no effect. Nineteen hundred eight. <laughs> Jesus. Um. Eight cost though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's, that's just hard not to do great. for. Um, I think his normal evolutions are going to be a lot better. This one is the one I was talking about. This earlier. one's amazing. So double red fist, which is new. Yeah. What are there decks that play red fist stuff? Are There's there Pekatrix that wants a, a red fist, right? Mm -mm. Nothing wants red fist. Um, the new Pyro Serpentis core wants one, um, and then Chaos Serpentis core wants one. Yeah. They both get effects off of it. But landing on it, this Auralis Bakugan gets 1,200 B-Power off the bat. Plus, if you're on this, you're getting 250. Yep. So you're at 1,450. Yep. With two damage, but you're getting... No, 1,450... Four. Four. 1,454. That's insane. Versus three. It's so 250 five. plus... Yeah, goes with 250 plus 3, so 5. That's insane. Yeah. That's busted. I don't know... I hope this thing doesn't evolve. <laughs> oh, it definitely does. <laughs> plus 2,000 V. That's going to be crazy. All right, these guys just look dope. So yeah. 
They're really uh, cool. Darkest 503, double helix, interesting. Double um, shield here. 601, that could be cool with Nilius. Um, let's move on here. Now we're going to start getting into some newer stuff, like my boy. Uh, but we've seen the evolution for this. We don't have this yet. We don't have it. We do it. have the evolution. Evolu uh, evolution's good. Right, right, right. Uh, another magic shield. Mm-hmm. Two, oh, two double helix guys here. So double helix decks might be coming up. Don't forget, double helix has that plus six hundred uh, core. Plus six hundred minus three. Minus three. So that something to think about. But this Orlis one gives you frost damage. Why frost strike? There is a helix core that gives you plus three hundred plus three though, which is pretty good. Yeah, uh, the Pythion. Uh, getting into the Pythion, I love him. This darkest one is the most interesting one to me. If you win. All players must discard a card. Mm -hmm. So working with Darkest, that is a automatic trigger for your sacrifice cards. Um, and then you're also kind of hand-controlling your opponent a little bit as much as you win with him. Yeah, and his um, stats are good. Yeah, so maybe like re-roll effects with him. Uh, not re-roll, like roll-up effects with him, like uh, Bubble Net and stuff. So maybe playing with Aquas and mess your opponent up. At least control him a little bit. With 500 B-Power, with an evolution on this, maybe saying discard two cards or something. Or maybe only your opponent discards a card off of his Evo. Might be cool. Uh, the Hayas one. Or pick a player to discard two cards. Right, yeah. So you could. Or, yeah, that, that'd be cool. Um, I love this color. Mm -hmm. The purple. Mm -hmm. Man. Uh, we have a picture of Lupithion here. Uh, so this is the Lupithion figure that we're getting. And it is beautiful. Yeah, Did we go really over nice. anything else that was on here yet? Nope, nope, nope. nope, nope. Alright, we'll be back to that. Mm -hmm. Anyway. Uh, Lupithion Ultra for Chaos, Domination, uh, you get plus four. That's fine, but the 400 B-Power I think is going to hold this back, but again... Holy Flame. Holy Flame. So, let's go. what is it? That gives you B-Power too? It gives you plus 600 if you're holding a Green Fist. Right, so, you know, this might actually be a cool lot. That's this one, right? Was it Chaos? Yeah, so there he is right there in the flesh. Um, Ventus think, 503. I think it's good. Uh, this? Yep. Yeah. Um, I go, like it. Go up to 800. Go up to 800. This. And then you go Possibly to 800. 600 just to win and then, you know, play some Ventus cards to give you some... some or you can just go up to 800 power. with that and then plus 3. So you get 806. Yeah. And then I, the way I play Ventus, I play a lot of, like, fighting cards. So I get a lot of B-Power boost anyway. So... I like him. Mm -hmm. We'll see about that. some Mantanoids, of course. Some bugs. Uh, this is new... Uh, we've seen all this stuff already, but Do double shield, uh, 403, uh, I don't know if we have an evolution We do. Hypermantanoid, two costs, when this opens, you may swap one of its Bakugan's Baku cores with the opposing Bakugan. Okay. So you could play, like, trap cores. Right, right. Um, re-roll on the darkest one, we've seen that before. Uh, new stuff here. <clears throat> This card looks so good. I think this will actually be good. Because Double Strike is nuts. Right. Uh, Not this. This, this, this one's one, bad. 103, no. This one's trash. No. But Unless I can't it, wait to have this Even if it has a good evolution, <laughs> you still can't... It even, better be a one-cost evolution can, you probably that puts can't it up to 800. <laughs> well, I mean, this is like how core stats. But without the big boom of the evolution. Yeah. So, I mean... But it gets Double Strike. Uh, this man, this man is not winning a battle. <laughs> I know. At all. Uh, so moving on. Well, what's your excuse for this one? He gets plus a lot. Yeah, I guess. So double helix. He can go up to seven hundred. Yeah. So double helix. If he lands on a helix, you get two. So you could be at about, say, you do the three hundred three. Seven hundred. Seven hundred. If you do the six hundred. Seven hundred, and then you get plus three. You could get a thousand. Okay, you nothing. don't want to use the 600 because you don't it, then, want to, then your double strike's negated. But you can add to it. It's Pyrus. You have, you know. I think the 303 is better because then you go up to 12. But this card looks so good. I can't wait to get him. That looks so good. Uh, new stuff. Dang, I didn't pull up the figure of him. Um, so Nobilius uh, is a really cool, like, uh, what do you call those? Griffin? Bakugan, mm -hmm. uh, he's in the show a lot. Uh, I think Dan's gonna get one or something uh, because I always show him with him. Anyway, uh, he's Pyrus mainly in the show, uh, but 503 is nice for Aquas, uh, really nice. And then he's got a, a magic shield and a green fist. No, 
regular shield. I mean, regular shield and a green fist. Uh, he's cool, but let's look at the rest of him. This one looks so cool. I actually um, don't really like the art here. I don't like the art, but the stats are great. Yeah, stats five, are really good. Five, six, one. Uh, but he's green fist, so this is a pretty hardcore Pegatrix partner. Uh, because you, you can Ooh. attach a green fist to him. Yeah, that just gives you instant domination. Yeah, domination and mega punch, more domination. So, mm -hmm. I used to, because uh, stand together is great, and I, I always have the problem of not having domination. This is, I'm interested in this one. I hope this one doesn't come out too late. Um, yeah, really cool. Uh, Pyrus version has a magic shield and a red fist. This one uh, seems good. If you land on either, you get plus two hundred. I like this one. Um, I'd be I'd be trying to land on that red fist more. I think to get the the boost here. Um, I mean, obviously, if you need to win, land on your. It's like it gives you option. I like it though. Uh, yeah, it's kind of, it's like, kind of like Titan Nilius's mentality of, do I want to get the big B power to win, or do I know I'm going to win? I need to hit the red fist kind of deal. Yeah. Um, I like this card because it gives me that mentality. I do like the options. Yeah. So, because, uh, what do we have now? The Ventus Fangzor Ultra? It's like land on a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Regular shield. Options, yeah. yeah. So, like, I like how they're building... Either, either of his cores. Yeah. They're building options into the baseline of the cards. So, cool. Pandox! Slaps. Big Panda Boy. Uh, he's a Pandox Ultra. Uh, he is only coming in Chaos as of now. And he's 702. With good. double red shield. Pretty so, good. a Nilius partner. Nilius Ultra, when I say Nilius. Darkest Nilius Ultra, mm -hmm. when I say that. Um, no effects or anything, but uh, off the bat, uh, I'd say decent. Because, yeah. I mean, on, on red stats. shield, you're getting 300, so 1,000. Uh, very strong. Just a little low on the attack side. Uh, Pegatrix, we've already seen that. Pegatrix Ultra Blue, so this is the one... Is this the one that has the evolution? Yeah. Yeah, so uh, pull it up. Uh, so 601 at the base, uh, but this one has an interesting Titan, evolution. Titan Pegatrix Ultra, four cost. Reveal the top card of your deck, and this gets plus damage rating equal to twice the revealed card's energy cost. And then it's 1,006. Yeah, so uh, everybody was saying that this card looked really cool, um, and we didn't know what this was, but now we do. Uh, so now we can actually start and playing. And it's pretty good. Yeah, it's pretty good. So we can start planning stuff around this card. Um, still don't have any uh, Pegatrix Ultra figures to test with, though. So, uh, we'll see. A shame. <laughs> shame. Shame indeed. Uh, we kind of knew about this already from Spin Master videos and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. uh, so, whatever. Uh, good, though. Uh, Magic Shield and uh, both shields. So this one has um, an evolution or out. Too. Yeah, the evolution is kind of like a souped-up version of the normal one. Pegatrix. Oh, no, that's Diamond Pegatrix Ultra. There we go. Hyper Pegatrix Ultra. Two cost. If it has two or more Baka cores attached to it, plus 500B. Yeah. Yeah. So you could... I mean, it's Chaos, so you get... Oh, his uh, Dynal is not bad either. Five cost. If it has two or more Baka cores attached to it, plus 1,000B. Okay. Interesting. What's his, what's the Diamond's B-Power? B-Power is 1,000. Oh, wow. Uh, 1,010. Yeah, I think... Pegatrix is going to have, a, uh, just judging off of his evolution, there's going to be a lot to do with him. Um, so it could be fun to play around with. Anyway, uh, moving on to the Snakey Boys. Girls, really. They're, Phaedrus oh, they, is yeah, a female in the are, show. Uh, but here is Phaed... Ooh, nope, just kidding. Uh, this is Darkest Phaedrus. Uh, we are getting a uh, diamond of Darkest Phaedrus. Um, this is going to be the core version, but we're going to get an ultra version. This is a core version? Yeah, because the magnet's on the bottom. That's huge. He's a long boy. He's longer than Fangzor because Fangzor stops about here, but his head flops out, and then he also has this. She also has this tail. Mm. Uh, so, um, so uh, this is that one right here, three hundred five with a magic shield again. Interesting and a uh, helix, which is a cool combination. Um, I don't think we have anything. We have a diamond for this, right? Diamond Phaedrus, yeah, four seven hundred nine. Yeah. You got a magic shield. It's got a magic shield, so... It's not bad. For darkest... I just don't like evolutions that don't have effects. Because yeah. I feel like I'm evolving for nothing. Yeah. Uh, Chaos Phaedrus. Uh, okay. I don't like the cores with this coloring. Uh, Pyrus Phaedrus. I love the art here. Slaps. Yeah. Uh, 305 with double... Double Red Fist. Um, so. Looks good to me. 
I mean, that's 250 plus what? Three? Yep. So, I mean... I About 58. Know. Yeah. Uh, play around with it a little bit. Good for Midas Indius. Yeah. Um, and stuff like that. I'm a, I think this is going to evolve into something pretty cool. Um, do you want to guess what the Bakugan elites are going to be? <laughs> In the next stuff? Uh, I th- uh, we went past well, one looks, earlier. Well, who? I think... One of the... I think Nilius Ultra... Pyrus might have one. Yeah. That's sure. way down the line, though. Yeah. Four months are... away. Yeah. Four months away from tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, Ventus Phaedrus. This one's cool. Uh, if he lands on the Red Fist, he gets plus 300, so that's 550. 850. 850. Eight. Uh, 858. So that is... So that's reasonable. Good. Very good for Ventus. Needs the uh, attacking power. I, I don't know if you have any that you this. play that can go along with the Red Fist deal right for Ventus I don't know I, I'm not I don't know the new cards yet <laughs> um maybe later down the line this will be a good Ventus option um Vice Rocks uh new Bakugan for us he's in the show You've, you know and love him from the show if you're watching the show uh here's the Ventus version and here is his figure uh so this is core Vice Rocks um, it looks really cool yeah he's a crab boy with a head it's kind of weird uh but there's a core and an ultra. I don't have the image of the ultra for you. Sorry. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's the last one. And that's the same one we just looked at. No, go. No, your last time. Oh, there he is. That's the ultra. We'll look at him in a second. Um, but here is the Ventus version, six hundred two. Um, so nine hundred five. Five plus three. Nine hundred five is pretty good. Yeah. Well, nine hundred eight. Mm. It's, you're playing a plus three. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah, uh, that's not awful. Um, I don't know what to, I don't know, kind of late. I don't really, I'm trying to think of stuff, and I saw all this stuff pop up, and we're trying to figure out stuff. Uh, moving on to the Ultra Fellow oh, Pyravian. Uh, oh, man. Moving on to, see, this is weird because I know we're getting an Oralist version of this. Yeah. Cause Simo and has we, don't, it. we don't have the card yet. Yeah. The card's not on here. Right. This is weird. Anyway, uh, Phaedrus Ultra. This um, one's okay. This one's cool, yeah. Uh, 701, but if you land on the Green Fist, plus 4. So this is your Oralist Pegatrix partner, maybe? Mm-hmm. Um, so that's cool. Now, I don't... The art for this, does it look kind of comic booky to you? That just might be the scan. It may just be the quality. It's probably just the scan. But his uh, color scheme is fantastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I love gold and black. <laughs> yeah. Who that? <laughs> oh, I'm from Louisiana, baby. I gotta love the Saints. Here we go. This card's um, bad. Uh, yeah, we've known this one for a while. Um, I don't like it. Don't like, I, I? I just don't care about Shadow Strike. Right there's, now. I think we're getting to it. There's one that gets Shadow Strike for something, and I think it's pretty good. Yeah, we'll see. Anyway, uh, Big Bird Boy, uh, Pyravian Ultra. This card looks awesome. Here is the Ventus version, but here is Pyravian. Uh, he is huge. Big. Uh, I didn't really real. Re- these pictures are way old. I don't know if you saw these or if you're new to the channel or whatever. Uh, but um, Simo has this, and he hasn't opened it yet. But we saw it in the package. It's huge. It's like I have huge hands, and it's like as big as my hand. Uh, so this is going to be really interesting to see if like he has like capabilities of like blocking. actually blocking people off of the matrix or like these wings have huge. Sp- I'm pointing at the screen like you can see <laughs> these <laughs> these wings have huge uh, springs in them, and like if this could not keep could do the spin shoot or something and knock him I mean the thing's down here so he's gonna flip maybe flip or flip I think he's gonna gargan away oh if he like flips under and then like pops out like in front I think he's gonna garganoid where he flips over where he flips like uh, oh, like up forward and back well you could spin him backwards and then he would spin under yeah he's gonna be something to play with anyway uh, here is we only have this but it's a double magic shield mm. The only double other magic shield we have right now is the Pyrus Halcor. You know what I'm going to put this in? What? My Nilius deck oh, yes. in place of my Aquas Nilius. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah. This is going to be interesting. Now, um, when are we going to get it? Probably never. But Yeah, I mean, it's got a resurgence on the card. <laughs> oh, it'll probably come out next month knowing the Bakugan distribution. Right. <laughs> uh, we might get it in the mail tomorrow. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> on accident. Uh, Artulian. We only have one oh, Artulian. We haven't seen a so figure. Good. This is all new, completely new to everybody, um, but this art is another nice. magic shield, and Artulian is just cool. He's a robot ninja Gundam 
dude with like jetpacks <laughs> and stuff. He's really cool. Uh, his he's, design slaps. Yeah, uh, his house faction is um, darkest, yeah. uh, but we only have this Pyrus one here. It's weird. Uh, but 402, whatever. Uh, he's just dope. <laughs> uh, Serpentis. That's a weird combination. I don't think we've seen that before, have we? Uh, probably somewhere. Probably on something not good. Um, seen this, seen this. Ooh. Know, actually, we didn't. This this is coming out in wave four. We have evolution for that, though. I know, but this, this is actually coming out in wave four. Okay. I saw a picture of it. Um, so this is coming uh, 300B, five attack. Do we have an evolution for yeah, that? Yeah, three costs. When you play this, give a Bakugan plus 400 and Shadow Strike. Uh, you may re-roll this once per turn if you miss your roll with it. I met, Oh, that may be the other thing. That may be the one below it. Oh. Oh, no, it's not. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, hold on. Wait, what? I'm getting very confused. Maximus Garganoid Ultra. It says you may re You no, can play this. Serpentis Ultra. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm getting confused on this. Garganoid's the play from the... That's the play from the discard? Yeah. Okay. So what's this? Uh, plus 400B, Shadow Strike. When you, when you play the evolution... You get the plus four hundred. Oh, okay. Cool. You just put it somewhere. Yeah. All right. Cool. So um, it's a basically it's a buff for a three cost, a plus four hundred B and a shadow strike buff. Yeah. Okay. Six hundred eight. Yeah. Whatever. It's all right. Getting on to new stuff. The scorpions. Oh, this has China on it. Oh, that's cool. I didn't see that before. Uh, so Scorporos, uh, we haven't seen this figure. Does this one not have China on it? No. no. Uh, that's weird, because China has a Maxator in the show, but not a Scorpros. Anyway, uh, Scorpros and Scorpros Ultra, uh, Max has a Scorpros, doesn't he? All the, th all, all three of all the, the kids. All the little, the little children, uh, have these. Mac, uh, Maggie. I like this Ultra version a lot more than the Core, though. Green Fist options here. Yeah, um, I like Scorpions. This one has a Green Fist, too, but... Uh, I like this the one. The Ventus one also has double green fist. Ventus one has double green fist. So these are interesting. Um, I feel like this doesn't help Ventus as much as it gives green fist decks an option. Um, so that's cool. Uh, I feel like either of these two evolutions are going to be okay. Just judging by stats. Mm -hmm. Trino, I am going to make a dinosaur deck. And Trox, it's going to happen. Trox, Trox, Trox Ultra, and Trino. Oh, come on. You need a third dinosaur. And then, uh, here's Trino here. That's cool. Um, this is, yeah, we don't have an Ultra. Very resemblant of... Um, Tartonium. Tartonium. Yeah, same uh, design. It's actually literally the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so he has horns. And I think his head is, like, detached here. Now that I'm looking at oh. it. Oh. Like, it, I think it's going to, like... Jet out a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. You hmm. might, might look a little different. Um, yeah, the base so is the Trino. Same. Uh, this paint scheme might change. This is the. Uh, it's like a hand painted version they do at the toy fairs. Uh, anyway, going. Uh, that is him. The right Orlis one was good. Yeah, so 305 double shield uh, for plus four. So you're getting you're plus getting seven. 700 off of shields. So you're getting 1,000. 10 5. So this one is cool. There's a picture of this Orlis one somewhere. That was um, really cool. Yeah. Hayworth one doesn't look bad. It's double helix. Right. Double helix, 304. Mm, cool. Uh, the darkest one, I'm not too interested in necessarily. I nope. love the uh, the art. It's kind of creepy looking. Uh, the the or, This one looks cool. Yeah, he's really he's like glowy. Glowy, all, glowy almost. That might just be a scan or something. Um, but this is the one from the picture. picture. Except his horns are yellow and this ones are green. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Uh, 304. Cool. Uh, moving on to the trucks. Is, Busted boy. Uh, this one's good. We have the Evo. We all know about the Evo. We don't have to read it out. Um, uh, you get action card. Whatever you play the action card, you get a bonus to the action card. So uh, this guy can kind of fit into any deck pretty much that's playing action cards. So Aquas, Ventus, Chaos 2, really. He's got oh, Green yep. Fist. He's got a Green Fist. So, Holy Flame, here we come. Holy Flame, stuff like that. Make a punch. I saw this, the toy for Pyrus Trox Ultra on Reddit today. Yes. Uh, he's rolling out in Wave 4 with us now with a Magic Shield and a Red Fist. Uh, 303, though. Do we? I don't think we have evolution for that, do we? If he, uh, I don't think we have one for the Ultra. Yep. We do? Yep. 
Titan Trox Ultra and Hyper Trox Ultra. One cost for the Hyper. When you play this, give a Bakugan plus three damage, 503. Not very good. And then a super rare Titan Trox Ultra Evo is five cost. When you play this, give a Bakugan plus one damage and double strike with a thousand three. I mean, with Pyrus, you have super fuel to get them out quicker. Yep. It's an option. That doesn't seem bad. Um, another uh, Trino. Another Trino slipped in here. 305 for Aquas. Uh, sorry, I'm moving the screen around a lot. Uh, Shield Fist. Pretty straightforward. Uh, Chaos Tritonium Core. Double Red Double fist. Red Fist. So, and if he lands on a Red Fist, it's plus 600. That's so, that's two fifty. So, 850. 1055. So, eight. Eight. That's good. Yeah. It's good um, for a core. Yeah. So, what was the the hydronoid the thing when it lands on this? Mm -hmm. That gonna, that deck's gonna be busted. Yeah, that could be a pretty good deck. That's gonna be really Coreless good. Coreless hydronoid ultra, tartonium core, and then I don't think we or we do have another another double red fist, don't we? I don't know. Uh, double helix here for oh, well, it's tartonium. I just opened that on my channel. Go check it out. Uh, all the ultra turtles. Woo. Uh, this is coming out now. Um, it's got a Helix and a Green Fist. If you land on the Helix, though, you get plus 100 to B and plus 3. Um, so this kind of lets you play the 600 minus yeah. 3 and even out. So 1,200 and then 2? Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah, 1,200, 2, and then you miss a roll. You can re-roll with it. Yeah, that's so bad. that's kind of neat. Um, this one's coming out now. Uh, Could you play Shadow Strike on your... Bakugan hmm. and not get the negative effect off of your own core? I don't know. I forgot. I think you can. Post in the comments. Um, I don't remember. I think the core's... No, because the... Yeah, I don't think they... It's just a negative effect. Yeah, it's... So it's, it's Shadow Strike will get it, rid of it. it. The rule is that it can't be negatively affected anyway. Okay. So, yeah. Cool. Uh, so that's the thing. Ah, Tritonium Ultra for Pyrus with a Red Fist and a Helix. Uh, 402. And it gets a reroll. Eh, I'm not too too excited about that one. Uh, another That's Viserox right. here. This is his house faction. If you were wondering, this art makes it look really weird. It looks like... It's really blurry. Yeah. Could I, be I scan. Uh, 207, not the best. This one's breaking a car in half, so that's neat. Uh, this one's got a magic shield, though. This one's double magic shield. Ooh. So he's 955, uh, which is nice. Um, so we need to put together... Oh, this is the one that I was thinking about earlier. Oh, magic shield gives you shadow strike. Yeah, so you're at 950 with shadow strike. Right, so that's cool. 956 with shadow strike, yeah. so you can't be reduced. These guys are going to be cool. Um, Probably one of my favorite Bakugan. Yeah. Crabs are cool. Uh, moving on, there's not too much left. Uh, just a couple more guys thrown in there. I love this art. Yeah, you get that log. Yeah, it's cutting that tree in <laughs> half. Uh, this one's destroying a lamp post. <laughs> These guys are crazy. Um, Fury, if you have no cards in hand, plus 800. Uh, I don't like Fury. I'm still not on the Fury train. Yeah, I'm not either. Uh, we have an Aquas Phaedrus. Uh, double Green Fist. So, you know, so, I've said it a million times this video. Pegatrix. Um, 450. So... so 650. 650. 10. 10. Interesting. Uh, and then, of course. Tides. Flow, tide, flow, flow, flow. Tides, flow. Uh, it's Green Fist, so play it with Pegatrix. Holy Flame. Holy Flame. All that good stuff. So, interesting. Ooh, you got uh, Holy Flame into Tides. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Quick plus a thousand. Holy Flame into Tides. Yeah, you're right. Here it comes, boys. What would that, that would that'd be like a four cost turn? No, it's, one, it's two cost turn. Tides is the four hundred one. Yeah. Oh, uh, wave well, slash. Still, yeah. wave slash is three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that would be plus sixteen hundred. Bust. <laughs> I'm here for that. Anyway, uh, Viserox Ultra and Oralis. This is really cool looking. Four hundred four. Uh, flat baseline. Depends on evolution, really. Can't say anything about yeah. him. Uh, more Viserox. I love the Ultra art. Be so strike. cool. Frost Strike is trash. Frost Strike, I'm not even going to look at it. 505, this is good for... Uh, Dang. With a Magic Shield. You play this with Dragonoid Ultra, you have two Magic Shields and two 505s. 
That's pretty nice. That's pretty cool. Um, judging on an Evo there, that might be a heavy hitter and Pyrus. Something like that. Um, probably going to get like a six cost Evo. Probably so. garbage and useless. Yeah, or like a diamond. Or <laughs> um, Visrox, oh, we got a double, uh, helix. double helix 502. If you land on the helix, you get 200 plus two. And um, I like uh, that for Ventus. Thousand. What? Is that a thousand seven? Yeah. If you did the three hundred three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah. Um, I like him moving forward with Ventus. Ooh. To the buggy boys. Uh, WebM, uh, four hundred five with a uh, double shield here. Pretty cool. Um, what are we getting? We're getting this now. Yep. And this relatively soon. Yep. I saw uh, that one on Reddit today too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's four hundred three. I don't like this one. I'm assuming. Oh, we have uh, evolution for this. I think we definitely have evolution for the WebM uh, Ultra Ventus. WebM. We do not. We don't. We yeah. definitely have one for the Ventus though. Yeah. It's the Titan. We have two. Maximus WebM Ultra. Well, that's one's a core. Yeah, it is. Uh, one's diamond. That's the mm. core one. So at baseline, Max he's got a re-roll. Seven. Seven costs, and you get the re-roll, but it's 1,214. Seven costs too much, but it does a magic shield. Not for Ventus. Magic shield. Uh, playing with trucks, you get uh, magic shield, magic shield. Um, and Ooh. to wrap new, it up. New boys. Yeah, uh, Zentar, which is not talked about a lot. Uh, he showed up one time in the show on the little preview of all the Bakugan things. It was kind of weird. Um, but 406 on the Auralis with a uh, red shield and red fist. Um, I think Evolution's going to tell us more about him. Uh, and then the darkest one has a magic shield and a green fist. 204, but if you land on the magic shield, you get plus 5. So it is eight So it's like an 859, nine. uh, which is not the worst thing in the world. If you get oh. it off first turn, uh, beat a Hydras, beat... That that uh hydronoid. Oh god. <laughs> that thing's gonna be busted, man. Um so anyway, uh video's going on long enough. Uh I will leave a link down to this in the description. Uh it's on TCG player. Just go to Resurgence on TCG player and uh check it out. Make sure you um, click the character card thing so you can just look at the Yeah, all yeah, the yeah. Cards. Just go make sure you search by character well, I'll just show you. Uh you can do this, go to this thing, go to resurgence. Uh, and go all the way to the bottom here and click character card, and it will show you everything we just went through. Oh, hold on, go back real quick. What? To Where? Resurgence? Where? Like, just go back. Oh. It looks like some prices were out. Oh, yeah, they're starting so, to sell some yep. Resurgence cards. It's out. It's, uh, it's there. How much is, uh... Where's... Super Fuel. Super Fuel and Air Zero. Hold on, scroll up. What? $15. $15 for the How Core? <laughs> Side note, hold on, how do you find, how do you search on here? Well, it's it's so, done by best selling right now. People probably aren't selling their They're super probably fuels. not selling super fuels right now, you're right. Sort by uh, price high to low. By It'll price. be our sort products. High to low. Yeah, so there's not that much stuff being sold yeah. right now. All right, anyway, uh, sidetrack. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Um, this stuff's really cool. It's very exciting. At the same time, it's kind of disheartening because now we're not going to see new Bakugan for we're gonna get it. a long, long time. So, uh, this is what we're stuck with. Uh, there's a lot of future planning. Um, until we get the next set of cards is probably when we're going to see actually new stuff. Um, there's Maximus Dragonoid that's coming out with the Titan Dragonoid figure. So that's going to be happening with an evolution that comes with that Maximus Dragonoid uh, figure. Um, we have a Hyper Dragonoid that we don't know when it's coming or where it's coming from, which is a figure in itself, a Hyper Dragonoid. Other than that, guys, this is what we're rolling with for a long time. So buckle up, uh, get ready for some testing, uh, get your mind right. I and, guess this um, will be the these will be the ones we're just getting until we get the next cards. Yeah, that's what you said. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Hmm. So it'll uh, well, here you it'll go. be a while. Start buckle thinking. up. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching, and we will see you later. Bye.